I am Dr. Chinmay Kumbhar, consultant neurologist at Manipal Hospital, Bane. Today I will be speaking on migraine. Headache is a very common disorder in today's population and migraine is the most common cause of headache. Not all headaches are migraine and hence it is very important to differentiate migraine headache from other very serious types of headaches. How is the headache in migraine? The headache in migraine is typically unilateral that is it is present on only one side of the head but in rare cases it can be present on both sides of the head. It can usually last from 4 hours and can go up to 72 hours that is 3 days. It is associated with nausea and vomiting. It is classically worsened by very bright light or very loud sound and patients with migraine cannot function normally in their workplaces. There are some associated symptoms of migraine which are present apart from the headache. These are excessive yawning, excessive urination, excessive sleepiness, irritability, depression and fatigue. These symptoms are as debilitating or rather more debilitating than the headache itself. The next important point is trigger. What is a trigger? So trigger are specific factors which can trigger the headache in migraine. And these triggers can be different for different patients. This can be very bright light, very loud sound, any pain, any stress factors or any very noxious strong smell. Coming to treatment of migraine. There are two parts of treatment. First is the abortive therapy and the second is maintenance therapy or the preventive therapy. What is abortive therapy? Abortive therapy is which all of you must have tried some over the counter medications like naproxen 500 which is used to abort the current episode of headache. And what is preventive therapy? Preventive therapy is to prevent further episodes of migraine. The need of preventive therapy and the drug of choice in preventive therapy will be decided by your neurologist. As we all know, Prevention is always better than cure. Migraine is supposed to be a lifestyle related disease and hence healthy lifestyle modification is the only way to prevent migraine. Avoiding triggers is the first and foremost thing. These triggers can be different for different people and hence these triggers are to be avoided to prevent migraine. The next thing is a good continuous 8 hour sleep throughout the night is necessary. Good hydration of around 1.5 to 2 liters of water a day is very necessary to prevent migraine. And lastly, reducing the screen time. But this is not possible in today's age. So at least an alternative is to use a blue light cutting glasses which can help in reducing the frequency of migraine. If all the above precautions are followed and treatment is followed, migraine can be cured completely.